YouTube, welcome back to Quad Squad Chicago. Um, I'm Latanya. I'm here with Rob. And we are here just to discuss a few things about quadsquadchicago.com, our website. I hope you guys had checked it out. Um, so a few things that we have new that are going on is we have a booking. We have bookings available on our website. Um, so if you are interested in you know, having videos taken of you and us editing them, then make sure you go and book. Um, Our services uh, are on there, merchandise, um, other products, um, social media links, everything is pretty much on there and uh, more. And how you can contact us through email support is on there too. So it's pretty official. Um, the way how we're going about this is even though at first we're skaters first, but to us, it's, it's a business, so it's a different side to it. So as we mentioned in other videos, if you guys stick to long enough a lot of your videos, because I've seen the watch time, a lot of it's not adding up, so I'm going to get into that too. Um, she mentions all the time, and I tell her to mention it for a reason, because she's a professional photographer, so she has a professional business on the side. She ain't got to do this, but she's doing this out of the kindness of her heart. But because of that, um, I want to get to this too. As a videographer, new in the game, as making a business too, when I say business, that means money. I'm not looking at it as like, okay, I look at you guys' money like, at the end of the day, we're all family. But then again, we got to eat too. You know what I'm saying? It's inflation. Time's a little hard. So um, her, as a photographer, uh, as somebody who's booking her, I, we don't expect to get free shoots from her when she's booking a... Uh, a studio, certain equipment she got to bring from her crib, you know, wherever she lives at to point A to point B. That's not going to be free 99. And you want to go to a barbershop who's licensed and ask for a free haircut and let that person, that barber just be okay with that. So treat me with the same expect, uh, uh, respect because I'm doing the same thing, if not investing more in my time because I'm editing hours upon hours trying to make you guys look way better than what you guys are, even though you guys are really awesome. But I see a lot of mistakes because I catch it on camera. And because of that, I have the power to change the narrative. Not to, to my horn, but it's just what it is. And because of that, I take my craft extremely seriously. I, I put thousands of dollars into this to make you guys look awesome because you guys are awesome at that day. And because of that, treat me with the same respect because I treat you guys more than respect by putting y'all on my platform. So just come with that same respect, okay? That's one thing. Um, so that being said, basically, if you're going to be asking for videos after like an event or after just a session, just expect to be hit with like a price because I mean it takes, like he said, it takes a lot of time to ed edit these videos. It's not just a a quick edit where we film you for thirty seconds and then we slap our uh, logo on there and and send it out. Like no, this takes hours to edit. I mean, even though it is a minute and thirty second video. We gotta add the music. We gotta, you know, change the color grading. We gotta do this and that to the, this lighting. video, the lighting, all of that. So, yeah, this is not. I mean, it's it, like I said, it takes a lot of time. So it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna cost something if you want your video. So just be aware of that before you start, you know, asking for the videos. Yeah, you can like expect. You can expect a collab. I have no problem with that. But as far as having you in your personal files the actual unedited raw footage or the edited footage where I spent the hours in your personal phone you can show your friends in personal time. That's what's going to, you know, obviously expect the price. And honestly, it's not that expensive. So um, expect about, you know, a certain, well, you can hit me up in the DMs or not. I'm not going to that detail because it can depend on. Well, they're on, on the website. The prices are going to be on, on the website. It's on the website too, but it can also differ too. But, you know, stay tuned for that. Look out for that. If you want, if you want it, you'll hit me up. Period. People have been hitting me up, period. It's more of them. Um, second, uh, so as I said before, the watch time hours on YouTube has not been matching. So there's a lot of, I'm not saying crazy comments. So me, I'm not sure you guys know this. We guys have noticed. So I don't, particularly for a reason, I don't entertain a lot of comments. I heart it. With Quad Squad Chicago Talks, I haven't been hard like that really at all. I don't entertain it because... Um, it's an open discussion. Because of that, um, uh, I want you guys to talk. And in those comments sections, 
Um, I've seen some crazy stuff that's not crazy. I've seen some crazy stuff on other podcasts, but I see some stuff that kind of question the knowledge of our stuff. And it's like, and the person we're interviewing, which is ridiculous because these people have been doing it longer than some of you guys have been alive. For years. Nine years before people have been in the womb, being straightforward. And I've done my research. I've done this stuff. You know, she's getting started with this, but she knows a lot more than a lot of people know because the people she's around, we give her that, we give her put knowledge on her. So she's not naive. She knows what she's talking about too. Cause you put game on her. So she's knowledgeable too. My point is this, um, because of that, I want you guys to have different opinions because I know you guys have different opinions. You're entitled to your opinions. But with that being said, um, the point is discussions because I want to grow the community as a whole. And because of that, um, it has to come to certain topics we have to address. It might not be what we want to, but how can we grow a community if you don't talk about the uncomfortable things? We can't grow if we just be uh, stagnant. Okay, we're going to put it to the side. Guess what? If nothing changes, nothing changes. So we had to change the narrative. Because of that, we had to come together, right? And a lot of times, we're not coming together. We're just putting stuff out there. We're going out there, think things are going to be sweet. And it's not sweet. It's bitter. It's nasty. And I'm putting that on blast. And what's, what's bad is about it is because you guys are assuming from a minute 30 clip and taking that and running it and making stories and these long paragraph essays that honestly I'll be straightforward with you. We go home, we laugh about it, and we say, you know what, it's crazy because- You didn't watch the whole video. You didn't watch the whole video because guess yeah. what, I'm looking. I'm looking, there's only like one or two comments combined. And the only person that actually came to me for like two or three people in person, guess what? The energy is different. I'm not gonna talk about you, I'm not gonna get mad at you, it's not person because at the end of the day we're going around circling for two hours, we go home, go nine to five, whatever, y'all do. I don't care, it's my business. But it's not that deep, right? Yeah, it's deep to extent, but it's not that deep to where it's it starting to become disrespectful on a personal level. Mm -hmm. So because the comments are starting to get a little disrespectful, so you could tone it down and tone it down. Otherwise, we're gonna have to block you from our page. I'm not blocking people. Um, guess it, it gets that crazy, yeah. But personally, I want we I, want we want to we want to hear your opinion about you know what we're talking about, but keep it keep it professional, keep it respectful on the page. Because we don't disrespect you. You're right. You know, I, I, if you want to come talk to us in person and come talk to us in person about it, you can DM us about it. Even if you want to be in the interview, like if you if you have that much stuff to get off your chest, then you know, ask us to be in the interview or ask to be in the, uh, interviewed, and we'll interview you. You know, but I said it's nothing. It's not that big of a deal. But it's just uh, I just feel like this was going to happen. I just feel like personally it wasn't going to happen this fast, and I feel like people are um, misguided. Because they want to get, you know, they don't look for what they look for their personal perspective. I want to know everybody's perspective. Um, for example, I'm gonna give you an example of how you know, I'm gonna go too detail about this, but there was one about the um, this, um, uh, the S word sales. You guys know what I'm talking about because that was going crazy. That was going crazy in that. Um, and that video per se. Uh, I put that for a reason because I want to see the, the um, uh, I, I got it, I got it. I want to see the uh, comments in there because I knew it was going to cause some ruckus. And uh, there was a lot of people that said it was rhetorical. The question was rhetorical. And I find it naive because it's no diss, but if you feel like, you know, if I'm dissing you, then it is obviously you. The shoe uh, sits. Yeah, but you gotta look it from other people's perspective. Not everybody knows that, right? It can be rhetorical to you because you go through that. You can you can have a certain build. You can be built a certain way, and that's fine. Wear a certain clothing, and it can be not promiscuous. It can be a certain attire. It can be fine, but to a general, it looks like you sell the sex. I'm gonna say it because I don't, I don't care. Um, but. If you go to little Timmy across the street, he don't know sex sales at the at the rink, nor does ma mama or daddy. You know what I'm saying? That does it casual, casually. So is it rhetorical to them, and they don't know it? They, you know what I'm saying? They're not part of the community. 
as somebody who's not a part of it or it's rhetorical to you because you know it because you're a part of it. And you see it all the time because you go to their, their sessions four times a week. When little Timmy goes every six, seven, eight months because he's not, he's not too you know, familiar with it. So like, stopping it from your perspective and think about it as a broad. So that's how I just almost say. Uh, we still want to hear your opinion. Like I said, we want to hear opinion. That's why we keep having um, more videos. I got one coming um, from a YouTube uh, uh, YouTuber. I was supposed to post it a minute ago, but we had some technical difficulties. It's coming up soon, probably the next couple of days. Um, very interesting, too. Um, also, two is I'm be uploading some YouTube videos about tutorials. So you see I got these, these, these digs right here, some van thing wheels. These are um, a real uh, uh, gem right here. If you know, you know. Um, I got van thing wheels, I got hybrid wheels, I have clay wheels, uh, Fomex, Harmonies right here, and people don't talk about this. I want to get into this, like, it's, it's cool to have skate videos and stuff like that, but at the end of the day, it gets kind of like, you know, it gets kind of repetitive. Me, her, we try to build something different, so we're going to add a little, little season to that. We're, we're not still over here. We, we, we put a little extra sauce to it. Uh, because of that, we take our craft seriously. Back to our first point, if you, you know, so we take you guys seriously with more, the most respect, respect the brand, you know what I'm saying? If we tell you, hey, it's a certain price, it's nothing personal. It's we, our business. It's, it's the business. We're running a business. We're running a business. Like, we got to pay bills as far as, as, far as the, the, the business and personal bills. So everything cannot be free. So don't expect, hey, he put hours, she put hours, you know, doing this and that, and y'all just get a free, y'all put your little, your footwork in for two minutes, and then y'all get a free video. Mm -hmm. It doesn't work like that, sorry. I mean, you can get a collab, but as, as, other than that, no, you don't get that. No, you don't keep that. Mm -mm. So other than that, stay tuned for the rest of the videos. We appreciate the support. Um, anything you want to say? No, make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe, watch the full video, and yeah, have a great day. All right, man, stay tuned, stay tuned. Got a lot of heat coming your way.